Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'll be teaching you how to get world edit for Minecraft 1.20.1 so you can do things like what I'm about to do here. You can set entire mountains to air, you can do so much cool things, so many options. But yeah, let's get into it. So the very first thing you're going to want to do is head over to the first link in the description. It will bring you to this ad focus page. And from there, just wait your five seconds and you press skip. From there, we're going to download the recommended Forge version. And we're just going to press installer. It will bring you to another ad focus page. Just wait the five seconds. It's fine. And press skip. Make sure not to press anything on the page. Nothing like that and it will download in the top of your screen. Now we're gonna download World Edit, link for ties, free access with ads, press I'm interested and press explore website. You'll be able to tell it's going because a little thing will be turning and now you just have to wait uh, probably about another five seconds and you just press I already completed this step at the bottom. Now we're at the world edit page, we're just going to go ahead and press files. And as you can see, the very top file will be 1.20 and 1.20.1. And there we're going to press it and just press download. And as you can see, now we have five seconds to wait and it started downloading. We're going to press keep because it is completely safe. So. From there, we're just going to drag both of those onto our desktop just to make this whole process a little easier. Now, what we're going to do is open up Forge. Make sure you open it with Java, as I'm doing right here, and run it. Once it's open, we're just going to install the client. And once it's done installing, Everything should just be working just fine. You should get this screen. The only reason why you wouldn't get this screen is if you haven't ran Minecraft 1.20.1, just a vanilla version. So if you haven't, go run vanilla Minecraft 1.20.1, close the game out, and come back here and redo this step. But now we're just going to press OK. And now we're going to open up the Minecraft launcher. And it should just be right there. Forge should just be right there as it is for me. If it's not, go to installations. And first, make sure you have modded checked. See if I uncheck it, it's not there. But when I check it, it is there. If that's still not working, new installation and type in Forge and just press the version you downloaded. I have multiple because I've done multiple Forge guides, but there should only be one for you. Now we're just going to press the folder button that's up there. And it will open up your .minecraft folder. From there, we're going to go to our mods folder. But if you don't have one, we're just going to right click on your folder and go to new folder and type in mods, M-O-D-S, all lowercase. From there, we're going to just open up that folder and drag our world edit into it. Now we can run Forge. And once we get into Minecraft... As you can see in the bottom left, three mods loaded. We can go to our mods folder and check. As you can see, world edit is one of them. And now I'm just going to join a single player world to show what it looks like. But yeah, once we're in, I already have a wooden axe, but the wooden axe is the main tool. So if you just go ahead and get grab a wooden axe from creative or do slash slash wand, you get your wooden axe. It works either way, but to, the main way to use this is you left click somewhere, right click in the opposite area and do slash slash set. And let's just do, I don't know, acacia um, fences. And as you can see, it just made this massive thing of acacia fences. But let's say I don't want that. We can do slash slash undo and it brings it right back. Or let's say we want to air. We do slash slash set air, and as you can see, it's all air now. But there is also tons of other commands you can do. I'm not going to go through all of them because I don't even know what all of them do. 
you can search it up what the commands do or I can just link it in the description whatever you want but really that's about it thank you so much for watching if this was helpful like or subscribe or both if you have any questions leave them in the comments so yeah see you guys later